again here on the jet. Pushing forward, does manage to find one. Skirts away with 12 HP. Managed to make that exit nice and easy as Munchkin on the opposite side. Finding a kill of his own with the Sheriff. Meteor will be able to push forward, takes him down. Fan now out of the fight and Munchkin swarmed. We find ourselves now in a 3v3 as T1 get in a position to try to go for this retake. It will help out. Smoke does come down. Meteor doesn't want to try to push in front of this. Yes, he does. He will be able to find one. Takes a blast pack out. Trying to get the remaining. safety. Sia player finding one before falling the God Dead. And that's going to leave Zayden out. The 1v2. Pain Shells goes his way. He's got to jump off the spike. And the shot through the box. Meteor gets him pace. Dashing down in towards tree. Some shots flying. How do you feel about it? Round three. Oh. Showstopper, but Sia player is having none of it. Catches him in the head midair, shuts it down, gets rid of that early alt. And wow. Man able to drag across spotting Eco before the smoke comes down from the sky. Spike on the floor. TS finds one, brings us back into a fairly winnable position given that Zeta is at 10 HP. Swing around the back though, Munchkin able to come up with that elimination. That leaves King now on his lonesome. Looking to play with the Sheriff since he knows he's going to be at range, but Munchkin might have went out that round and they fall shy of the mark. Oh, God. Third forward, though. Zaya player just taking a nice cheeky blast pack out. Nothing more that Eco could do there. King now gone. Ben, however, looking, lurking forward, trying to get arcade control, but completely disregards the underpass, and TS makes quick work of him. Well, interestingly enough, Munchin up by tower with a judge. Turns away from the flash and will be able to find one. Do they continue to push into him? The answer is yes. God dead. Going on the chase, and we'll just eat a couple ticks of that aftershock. As the lockdown gets used outside of tower. Rolling Thunder spent as well. Eco still holding on to his. Not needed. It's a quick adjustment to try to win that one out. But now getting information up by tree as well. Yeah, it's <laughs> not dang. needing Van. Munchkin holds it on his own. God dead. Will get one. TS finds Ban. Good kills to be found. Null Command going to be committed to the round. Sorry, right, wants to close the distance. And yep, point blank. TS gives his life over to it. Fault line catches both in tower. It's Eco and God Dead locked in place, and God Dead with the Vandal loses out of the first fight. Now leaving Eco in a 1v3. Two positions. Both to cut him off. He pushes in. Finds one. TS as well. Okay. Both available. Uh, hello. Man um. <laughs> taking his time. Does get spotted. Now Blades have to be pulled. Oh Instantly my. gets two. Man. Dashing to the side, oh! gets the fourth, and suddenly is on for the ace. TS now on his lonesome spike strand, and time is gone. Team one. Well, He's there. Get the ace. Go, man, go. <laughs> oh, okay. Carpe. Towards Jet. Smoke's now coming down. God dead. Just making his presence known since it's some straight shots, and actually does get a clip there on Asaya, but Zeta responds in kind, and his is a headshot. Go still trying to play around the smokes. Ben, Ben here hears rotations. all those footsteps. Once he decides to swing, well, the answer's gonna be now. Munchkin does get taken down. Pain shells to try to clear. Oh, and he's in a rough spot, but covering fire is there. Zeta gets himself up in the tower. Meteor, however, replying. Three kills now, needs the ace. Try to get Genji another pistol round win, but spots Carpe. Carpe wins it out despite the classic disadvantage. With his toxic screen, trying to hold off T1, but rolling oh thunder gets sent. And it's gonna find both. God dead. Sat here taking a couple pot shots, Ban trying to clear the way. Friends with the shorty. The re okay, good. Okay, the regress from King does find it. It's a one for one, but now Sia finds TS as well. Push oh. out of the smoke. Eco, good for one, but Carpe guns him down with the frenzy, and now they have here. access. To attack, to defend their spawn rather, and they're just gonna retreat and they're gonna take the A site. Playing together and smoking it off as well. They spend oh, it by King. Okay. Great timing. Great judgment. Carpe eliminated. Zeta should have seen one crossing over into the site. He put some damage down to the King, putting him at 11 HP, and that should oh. be enough, but Munchkin cannot steady the spray. And with 11 health, King. I wish Sideshow were here. Anyway. Onto it. Was he stuck? Was there a fault line? I didn't notice. Either way, the god that gets one carpet trades it back. A man advantage. It's Gen G. Need to retake this tower. site. TS? TS. I mean, it could be everything, but it's going to be a one for one at the end. The media will find Ban to bring in the equal numbers. T1 has all the information at hand, though. Last player King. Winning out of the one, and Munchkin! He's just looking to hold the line. Ban. 
pushing forward, rushes Good out hit. onto the side. King finds one. Showstopper now at the ready. Whoa. Jumps out. King will be able to get one. God then gets another. Brings it back into a winnable position, but Carpe gets the elimination right as that. Paranoia expires. Munchkin sneaks in. Spray into the smoke. Oh, and he is playing sneaky. Oh, Eco. Bit faster to react. Finds him. TS. Very well, Gresh off of the spike plant. Break on the zero point. Ban finds one. Carpe gets another before he gets taken down. TS and Eco once again. The two members the left alive. This could be the round. See Eco thinking about it, but he's going to be caught with a flash. Taya finds him. Ban looking for the shot. Swaps to the shorty, and he's going to be able to win it out. A 3K from Ban to go ahead and get them over the line. 13 8 is the score as T1 will take their map pick of Fracture. Zinji are holding it though, anticipating anything, looking for that first pick. Looks like they're ready for him to be aggressive, but the headshot comes in. Eco will be able to finish him off. So a little bit faster, a tiny exchange. T1 now regrouping. Munchkin will back. Oh, and he gets a headshot for it. Pretty damn crisp. Fragment out. Carpe looks to slow up the advance. Drone going to be going forward. It sends out a stray shot through the smoke. And OK, Meteor as well just moves up into this. Do they read it? He's about to swing out, spotted. Woo, quick little flick to the side. Chest shot will get him done. Kill is found, plant does come through. Can they hold it versus three? One by B made. Oh Watch my goodness. Another. I mean, talking about how he's running without his U-tilt. Only the turret in the mix, and Munchkin is getting absolute value out of the Sheriff, a 4K for him. As well. Guys looking for a peek. Just get the ping. And Munchkin trying to play off the back of it. Good for one, good for two. Ban in the meantime finds Spike God Dead. Down, mid. I don't know. They have his left. Last Seda wins out on the fight versus King. Now it's all on yeah. TS. Checks market for the swing. And now Munchkin will take it away. Still going to be used. Hunter's Fury comes across. Oh, They're going to break smart. it down, but now King gone. TS finds one, Munchkin gets another, Saya, they just sweep their way through. The Fuse can come in, and T1, down to 1100 with that. Oh, oh, okay, up over the top. Meteor getting like one, that. but it's going to be a trade out of the KOs here. Oh. As Meteor gets another, oh. looks for a third, and he finds Seda. And that is the kind of speed and aggression that Genji have been needing. They're trying to catch them, oh. Meteor finds another. Now on for the ace to try to pull off the Stripty. How badly does he want to hunt for it? Well, he's not going to get the opportunity. Tucked away here in hell, he does, but Domes one, looks for a second, can't quite make it happen. TS finds the kill, but Saya player with a quick adjustment. Oh, oh one God. spotted, and Munchkin reads Eco's position beautifully. Finds the kill, and the op shot will be the finisher. Just to check wine, Just make sure that no one's going to be in that spot. Paranoia does go across, catches a few. Ban very much making his presence known. Now swings out, gets a second. Zeta also took down Meteor. Oh. And it's just yes. an absolute. It comes down to those firefights, and T1 has been winning most of them. Munchkin, in particular, has been an absolute demon. So sharp. Just unreal. Okay. From the Sheriff beginning to now. A ban does get suppressed here on the site. Push oh! out, and it's Carpe actually gunning him down from the flank. What on earth? Ban will be able to get one, but yeah. Working their way forward. Munchkin holds the up, gets a quick shot across. Meteor gonna be taken down, but Eco wins out on the Zeta. Full flash, has to back away. Does so, they get themselves okay. into the site and now have Good. the lock down to boot. And it swings in. Yep, Zaya taking it down. Now a 3v3, but position. Their adva the advantage is there for the side of Gen G. Lockdown was destroyed. Answering lockdown comes across. Munchkin can't adjust fast enough. But this Fury has to be used to try to clear this one. It's all on Ban. Does he swing? Crosshair a little bit too high there. It's the recon. Not spotting too much. Right on the opposite side of the box. Finds one! No way. Suddenly Ban in with a pinch. Sees him on the opposite side, okay. but the shorty is there, and Eco. Like they want heavy presence around mid. Off the rip, though, Eco noted. They know exactly where he's at, but still managing to find one. God, they're trying to play surprise in the corner. Does put some damage down, sets up for that single kill to be coming through. Good hit. Eco now continuing to push, and Meteor gets in behind. One more! And there it is, and that's yep. what we want. Monstrous surprise. 
Fragman shows him back into the corner. He goes pushing forward. Meteor, good for one, looks for the next. Seda will manage to stay alive, but he's down to a sliver and he's completely locked in place. Got that low himself, but they get the timing there on that reload of the gun. And now it's just Carpe and Saya to try to hold the line. Carpe about to face off with everyone. The gun barrel spotted. They swing into him. He just can't stand up to him. A low Saya player, too. 25 HP. Up by Heaven. Has He's got to respect that turret. And tries to play off the timing of it. Seen as well with the Guardian. Start pushing their way out. Meteor finds Saya. The drop down here into the side. Ban Carpe with the Stingers managing to find some kills. Now suddenly it's all on King. He's swinging around. He spots one. But oh. Ban with a classic will finish the job. As he jumps over the top of it. Dash in. Tag here on the switch. The door going to be shut. Two players now. King as well as Eco in on the site. Up over the top goes Saya. Finds one. Meteor in the meantime takes down Ban. Dashes out. He gets himself over towards switch. We still have to displace Eco. And Eco finds two. Ooh. The bang through onto Carpe and Santa. Saya now dead. Meteor gets Munchkin. And oh yeah. Rotates over, but this time. They just shut the door and he's trying to win the fight. Cannot do so. Only puts King down to 79. It's God dead. The approach from Saya could be everything. Noted, however. Munchkin looks for the counter swing. And they just can't equalize it. TS gets away scot free. Shots there. The spray not even connecting. Paranoia going to be used. Cloudburst only going to last so long. Meteor in the meantime, spotted, God dead, gets one. Fragment comes down to try to slow them up. Zeta swings in, catches the enemy jet. The flash across, God dead, looking to hold the line. TS, however, behind him, backs him up. Zeta gets another, but Eco gets Zeta. How do you Three players on flash? one, two on the other. Pop flash going out. Saya, the first to fall. Hunter's Fury now crashing across. Carpe, oh. Ban, gonna be good for one, but Eco finds Carpe. Ban, trying to play a loose sieve, swings out. TS is there. Avoids the shots, TP. Where's it gonna take him? He goes into the back. We'll have to cancel. 2v3, Gen G. The round, the map, seemingly in their hands. The spike as well. It is being held. Munchkin forced away. The dart at his feet needs to win. It can only get one. Okay, Zeta. The IGL versus two. Alarm bot of no concern. 30 seconds left. Checking one way, 30 seconds to try to somehow isolate this. Oh, Keep us in for OT. Fire. But they're looking for it. A smoke comes down. 15 seconds now remaining, Zeta. He has to win the first battle and he cannot! Eco takes him across the line. 13 to 11 and we are not Now you're sw swapping him out for Sylvan. Aunt reveals quite a bit. Hope has to be used to try to escort them out. Carpet down low. King gonna be able to find Zaya player to start things off. It's just a bloodbath in the smokes. Carpe re-swings, doesn't know which target to look at. Manages to find one, but in the end, it is a trade up, and it's also Gen G backing away from the seat position, at least temporarily. King wants to grab. The value they can find is the turret is there to play first contact. Munchkin. Getting worked lower and lower, and oh boy, the HP bar is just not looking good for T1. One enemy remaining. This looks to set up a smoke, but looks like it's not wow. even going to be necessary. Four members left standing. Looking for different approaches. They peek out. Oh! That's a tie. Really great. Don't, but he's getting body blocked. Carpe locks him out. Damn. God, that finds the kill. I mean, King's still going to be tagged down. Carpe going to look to try to turn this around as the Seekers do go forward. Backs off. Trailblazer out. Push coming in. Guardian's not going to be able to line him up. Zeta falling. Now Carpe Munchkin dead. It's all on Ban in the 1v3. TS and King. King working his way forward. He wants to maybe try to get the jump on him, but it's going to be Sylvan with three. Goes across. Check on the up and Sylvan. A tenth kill for him. Shutting down the operator. Zeta raising the wall to try to stay alive. And the Prowler's on him. And somehow he actually manages to get Meteor to boot. Oh my God. Or Munchkin rather. Covering fire. Finds one. Pushes out of the back of the flash. Okay. Lockdown's invested on either side. Suddenly a 2v2. Both teams needing to back away and exit. Waiting, crosshair lined up. Man would need to be Johnny on the spot, but King just far too preset. Turret gets cleared. Swing the corner, finds one. Munchkin 
with a chance. He and saw he it. gets it! But so far, the early round aggression has not really paid off for them. Now we have Playstorm oh, versus Playstorm. They know exactly where Sai is at. They managed to flush him out. Zeta, a little bit of covering fire makes it a one for one, but the Sylvan trades up. Munchkin going down. Talking about the economy here for the side of T1. They need to hold on. Genji's as well has taken a decent hit. It is worth mentioning. Van now creeping forward, finds one, looks to adjust, can't quite get God dead, brings it once again into a 2v2. A side open, the rotation's just now beginning. Oh, Sylvan. Yep. Creep all the way forward. Spike Zeta, planted. like he's aware that this could have happened. Here's spot. Okay. He's seen enough, but Sylvan lines up the head, and Carpe's just not in a position. He wasn't playing up through the backside of B. Sips heard, waits out the haunt. Wisely played, but he still has no idea where God that is located. Look. Got full range of view till God dead. From the back of sight, now gonna be spotted. The Seeker going his way. Flash used. Not much concern here from the side of Carpe. Gets it up to half. God dead on the push. This could be the thing that allows them to spot the Viper. Fans hit. Knocks him back, but. Good time by, but yeah, Pan's still going to end up falling. Meteor gets himself in, puts some shots across. Zeta, widely ignoring it, guns down two. Is he ready for the left side flank? Yes, he is! Oh! And Zeta, what a transition! Picks up four, now he's on for the ace, but I don't think he reads that TS is around from behind. Darryl. The Munchkin's there, as is Saya. They will hurt. No kidding. Carpe, just holding. Very narrow angle, finds one Munchkin in the meantime, looking to drift his way out of stairs. Get the surprise shot, and he does, but Spike only he's able to come away with one, because Zeta takes down two. Looks like Genji maybe starting to get a bit overzealous. King will find the punish. Meantime, Bans just creeping around from behind. Alarm bot in position, can alert. Swings the corner, though. Zeta, just overwhelmed, and he can't quite... Still looking to play for but God dead. Just scoped in, headshots him, and Zaya. They're expecting it. Not having a good time of it. Counter lockdown will come through, <laughs> trying to prevent them from pushing into the site. They, Look at the in. jump up, but TS on the lurk around the side. Find Zeta. Lockdown destroyed. No catch found. Ban on a flank. Trying to get in front of him. It's Carpe. Noted has to exit. Is able to do so. Ban gets the jump. But a 3v4. T1 still with a man disadvantage. Carpe. No smokes for a couple more seconds. Munchkin Whoa. swinging around the side. Spots one, but cannot win the fight. King takes him down with a specter of all things. Carpe does find one. Oh, gets Sylvan as he tries to go for the turret, it would seem. Now it looks to hold on to the spike. Ban. Oh, no. Pulling the angle. Suddenly it's all on King. He pushes out. He was vulnerable. Oh. And Carpe will be able to get oh, off. The clear out some of this Killjoy utility. Sia player. Goes dashing in, the dog gets the sun, Sia swings the corner with a frenzy, finds one. King, however, answers in kind. He's at a one for one, but he's so very low, the band jumps the corner, finds him, and TS will also crumble. Two men approach now, coming in from the back side, God dead. Getting there, looks like it's going to be a swing around for Sylvan to get himself into Waterfall. No plant yet. Taking their time with this. Waiting for a while to come back up. Looks like for now, they might be reading that the fault line could come back through here in a moment. Carpe swings out. Fault line, however, not going to get the catch on the one. And God then continues to press forward with a flash in hand. Sylvan reveals one. Prowler goes in as he tries to rush forward. The ban not broken. No attention really being paid to it quite just yet. Zaya up and over the nano. Dog goes in, stuns the turret. Able to clear far enough back as TS gets himself up here onto the high ground. Wants to look to push ahead of the wall, but Ban swings into the back sight. King goes down, TS falls as well. Oh Saya finds God. God dead, and they are just getting torn asunder. Sylvan, gonna be good for one, but now it's a 2 before. He and Meteor have their work cut out for him. Spike not yet planted. Just now going forth. Go there. Gonna look to break, and he does. Oh. He interrupts it. Zeta trusting a bit too much in that. Ends up falling. Spike now. Held by Carpe. One HP remaining on the sky. Sylvan. Left. Goes for a drop. One enemy <gasps> he hits a headshot. Sylvan looking to bring it back. Unsure of his position. And Carpe only with the Spectre. 
Inches his way into the center, swings what? into backside, and Carpe, you absolute madman, you Gigachan! Here comes the swarm. TS swinging around the back, put some damage down, will be able to finish off Ban. It's Zeta as well. That's already quite a bit of value found. And some weapons that could potentially be recovered unless they want to juggle them all the way forward, but don't suspect that that is going to be the case. Prowler in from the rear should have been heard. Certainly something they're very aware of. Mine coming down, looking for the Whoa. rush, Meteor. Takes out Carpe, oh. Zaya, dead! Meteor looking for a little bit more. Munchkin, however, will find one, but they cannot get the rest. And it's gonna be a thrifty for Gen G to fire back, break this little win streak from T1. Knives here for Sai player. Wall going up, cuts off the C site. Dash over the top, Nano's still rolling. Carpe. Gonna use his updrafts just to keep himself above them. Site, however, widely is theirs. Got your trail. No waltz at the moment to try to flush them out as Munchkin trying to go on a big flank mission. All the way around, but now the spike Welcome has been planted the and the Viper's oh. pit will be deployed. Okay, fault line into the back, the reveal oh. against Seda. They take him down, that's the first step of many. Ban needs to try to win out. Blades, the right click, Saya claims one, swaps over, picks up a Vandal now. Push into the smoke, Whoa. Carpe comes in with two. King and God, that book's gonna be taken down. Munchkin off screen. Gets TS, and now it's all on Meteor. But as he pushes oh. into the smoke, they are prepared. A counter thrifty back to back. Cream, at least for T1 here in that regard. So far, what? not dead. What? what? Okay, I'm gonna need a replay on that one. Meteor as well, the Guardians coming up huge. I, I'm speechless. It's looking like Mon yet, but with a Guardian instead of an Odin. But it's not even really a full, true wall bang. He's just working off that tiny little sliver. Still just an insane amount of value found. That's one way to keep yourself in this. Munchkin, fast on the reaction, but Zeta now at risk, swinging around the corner. Granted, it is Spectre. a Spectre. That's why he's gonna play it safe, I guess. We might underestimate the Spectre, but I'm still remembering what Carpe was able to do with it. Yes. Mon goes down, Aftershock as well, gonna be invested. Back through the door? Zeta, yeah, he's gonna go through the door, cut himself over towards C. In the meantime, Munchkin, Munchkin in a perfect position no for a backstab. King gone, Meteor dead, and suddenly it's a 2v2. God that does hold on to the Rolling Thunder, but the lockdown is available for Munchkin, and he's gonna use it immediately. As they try to get the plant down, and they do. Rolling oh, Thunder roll across, thunder. it pushes Zeta, but he manages to make it across the wall. The Nano Swarm, no they have no the way. and Munchkin guns down the all of them! A 4K to close the round, to close the map! It's 13 to 7, and T1 will advance forward to take on Paper Rex!